Yahwa, call Hello Yumla, Yahwa, Bashim, Yabasha, Bashim, Rakakadash, Double Honors to the Apostles and Elves of Great Millstone, and the singers to hope left around the world. May Yabashim, Yabasha continue to protect and guide your steps throughout these turbulent times. This is Brother Dog, coming at you with another one. Okay? And today's lesson is they should not be confounded. Once again, they should not be confounded. And that day I'm talking about is talking about the helpful elect in these times, okay? They're not going to be bewildered in these times, nor uh, uh, led astray. I'm going to start off with the definition of confounded. Audacious, detestable, damn. Um, condemned, curse. Okay? A milder form of implication. Perplexed by many hogs like you. Put to mental confusion, okay? Con, all right, all right, down here in the word, and there we got perplexed by many conflicting situations or statements, filled with bewilderment, bemused, bewildered, confused, or lost. And the uh, hopeful let these times are not going to be confused of what's going on, you know what I'm saying, or how about go about uh, through their day to day. They're going to trust in Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah because he is. Uh, our way, you know what I'm saying, up out of here, you know what I'm saying, and on the way out is up in that chariot to the, uh, to, uh, uh, like you. <laughs> to, uh, escape, the, uh, the thermonuclear fire, you know what I'm saying, also the raging, uh, concentrated fire from the chariots, because they go putting in work too, all right, first gonna start if in, uh, Psalms 22, 4 and 5. Okay. Psalms 22, 4 and 5. Okay. Con. Psalms 22, 4 and 5. Our fathers trusted in thee. Okay. These fathers is talking about is talking about us. You know what I'm saying? Because we are our fathers. Back in the reincarnation. Because we trust in uh, Abaratazah with all them uh those uh, vessels fit for mercy, you know what I'm saying? But uh, we come back in different reincarnations, and uh, most of the uh, believers in the hopeful let they believed in Yahweh Bashai, Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai in their past lives, so they're gonna believe in them now, okay? They trusted, and thou didst deliver them, that's right, and Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai delivered uh, uh, those certain uh, vessels fit for mercy, those hopeful elect uh, members from uh different uh scourges, tribulations, you know what I'm saying, from the hand of the enemy. And he delivered them, okay? Verse five, they cried unto thee and were delivered. That's right. Our uh forefathers, which are us, you know what I'm saying, in reincarnation, cried unto Yah Bashim Yahusha, and he delivered them, okay? They trust in thee and having confidence in Yah Bashim Yahusha and were not confounded. Bewildered or confused, none of that. They knew what was going on and why they was being uh, chastised and uh, tried. You know what I'm saying? And that's the same thing that's happening now. We're being tried and refined to be made pure as gold. Okay. All right. Next, we're gonna get to like you. All right, con. Uh, next, we're gonna get. Psalm 69, 6 and 7, Psalm 69, 6 and 7, Con, okay, let not them that wait on thee, O Lord, Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah, power of hosts, okay, be ashamed for my sake, it's talking about the hopeful elect, okay, let not those that seek thee be confounded for my sake, O Lord power of Israel. That's right. He's talking about the hopeful elect. It's a prayer. You know what I'm saying? Let let not the uh, hopeful elect be confounded in these these times as fast as approach. Because we're gonna be tried, you know what I'm saying? Open is Yahweh Bashmi Yahweh Shah trying us, you know what I'm saying, to make us a uh, 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 worthy of the promises that he promised to us. That eternal uh, uh, eternal life, those immortal bodies our uh, heart desire, you know what I'm saying? Ultimately, uh, at the deliverance of uh, Yahweh Shah. 
and his second coming, okay? Verse 7, because that for thy sake I have borne reproach that shame, okay, shame had covered my face. That's right, because we uh it was shame because we went off. You know what I'm saying? Now it's shame because we're in his Lord estate. It's ultimately Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, uh, 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 putting those curses upon us and making us a uh, uh, reproach among all the nations upon the earth, especially among these damn heathens. Start with these Edomites. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't of their doing. It was all uh, uh, it was all of uh, the power of Yahweh that put these curses upon us. Okay? All right. All right. All um, right. That's gonna get uh let's see, let's see what we got. I'm gonna go with Psalm 71. Psalm 71 and 1. Okay, indeed, O oh Lord Yahweh, by Shem Yahweh Shai, do I put my trust or confidence? Okay, let me never be confused. That's right. And uh they hopefully are asking uh Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai to uh not put us to confusion, okay? Or put us into other darkness or turn his face from us. You know what I'm saying? Because we need Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. He's our only hope. You know what I'm saying? That's all we got is hope and his faith. You know what I'm saying? And only the uh, hopeful elect are going to have faith in these times, okay? And believe in the uh, unseen, okay? And believe that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is going to show up and show out. You know what I'm saying? When, when uh, the time permits. Okay. All right. I see uh, 45. 45. And 17. Okay. Come. This is talking about the kingdom right here. But Israel shall be saved in the Lord Yahweh by Shem Yahweh with an everlasting salvation. That's right. Because the uh, Israelites are the only ones that can uh repent okay and this obviously uh it's talking about the elect that's going to be uh saved out of the coming discretion world war three okay uh at yahweh shah's second coming but ultimately uh the whole nation of israel is going to be uh saved okay and put on high exalted okay on the yahweh shah all right ye shall not be ashamed nor confounded world without end that's right and we're not going to be confounded or shame he's going to take that shame away from us and all of these curses are going to be put upon our enemies and we're going to live forever okay that's new jerusalem okay all right uh let's see what we got uh we're going to get romans 10 okay 10 and 11 Romans 10 and 11. Okay, for the scripture said, Whosoever believeth on him shall not be ashamed. That him is talking about, talking about Yahweh Shai. And the uh, hopeful elect are the only ones that's believing on Yahweh Shai in these times. And calling on the true names of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai. You know what I'm saying? And that's gained the uh, wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of the scriptures and believing on the prophecies that's written. Okay. All right. Uh, Let's see what we got. Come on. All right. Um, let's go get First Peter 2 and 6. First Peter 2 and 6. Okay. Come on. Wherefore also it contained in the scripture, Behold, I lay in Zion a chief cornerstone, which is uh, Yahweh Shah, elect precious. Okay. And let's talk about the elect too. Okay. Uh, and he that believed on him should not be confounded. Once again, uh, the hopeful that are the only ones that's going to believe on Yahweh Shai in these times. And they're not going to be confounded. They're going to receive that grace and favor in these times. And ultimately, they're going to be saved. You know what I'm saying? Yahweh Shai's second come. We crack these clouds with the uh, normal uh, multitude of chariots. Okay? The chariots going to fill the sky, man. It's going to be beautiful. I brought this eye, you know what I'm saying? Well, they're hopeful knowing that I get to experience that, man. And they call hello, you know, like y'all about Shim Yahweh Shah. It's beautiful. All right, and it's going to get uh, two out the apocrypha. We got uh, Ecclesiastes 2 and 10, an all time classic. Okay. Right. Ecclesiastes 2 
15. Kind of look at the generations of old and see that's right because we have to uh, 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 think on the uh, acts of old, you know what I'm saying, that's written so that we can uh, get a glimpse into what's, uh, what's going to happen in the future. Okay, did, e did ever any trust in the Lord, y'all, by Shem Yahweh Shai, and what's confounded? No, he asked no question, or did any abide in his fear and was forsaken because we must fear y'all by Shem Yahweh Shai. In order to uh for him to show faith to us, you know what I'm saying? All right. Or uh, whom did he ever despise that called upon him? Nobody. That's no question. Okay. And ye hopefully are the only ones that's gonna call upon Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai in these times. Okay. Even if we have to go to a FEMA camp and get tried, we're gonna call. Upon our power, Yahweh, by Shem, Yahweh Shai, and ask him to deliver us from out of the hands of our enemies. Okay? Alright, last but not least, please, guys, this is also Rock 24 and 22. Okay? Alright, he that obeyed me shall never be confounded. That's right, it's about the hopeful leg. So, obeying the words and the prophets and altering the, uh, the things that's written. You know what I'm saying? That Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is written. Okay? And they that work by me shall not do amiss. And that word amiss, that means wrong. They won't go astray off the path of the truth. Okay? They're going to stay upon this truth and they're going to be faithful. And trust in Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah even unto death. You know what I'm saying? But it's going to end this lesson. I'm going to end off by saying Shalom, Kwam Yasarala, Wabak Shabak Shabak Shal, Yabashim Yawasha, Kwam Yawala, Zah and Wahashi Alma, and I am Yabuwa Matazah, Yahim Wabak Shabak Shabak Shal, Yabashim Yawasha, Shalak, the Gipatam on a woman, Wahashah, Wabba Ball, a Baba Ball, Baba Ball, a Baba Ball, Shalom.